Now, if that electrostatic motor didn't make a whole lot of sense, that's okay. We're actually going to break this down into smaller steps. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to get a balloon and blow it up and tie off the end. And then I want you to get a spoon and lay it down on the table and place a meter stick or a yardstick on it so it just balances. Now make this half kind of go over the edge of the table so it's easier for you to work with. Charge the balloon up, rub it on your head, and bring it next to the ruler. The ruler starts to move. And I can make the ruler go back. <laughs> this is the same thing that's happening with the electrostatic motor. Don't forget to charge it up again. Can you imagine how you could keep this thing continuously rotating if you had four people, one on each position, the three, six, nine, and 12 o'clock position? You could keep it spinning over and over and over. That's exactly what the electrostatic machine did, only instead of a meter stick, it was a water bottle with foil on the outside. Go ahead and give that a try.